So ladies and gents, welcome back to the vlog. I know we've been missing for a couple of weeks, but there's been a good reason. Unfortunately, on the 5th of October, I tested positive for COVID. I've been ill for a couple of weeks. I don't know how far we'll get today, but uh, we're only doing 90K, I think. Going to Wincanton and Sherbourne. There's hardly any climbing. Uh, <laughs> well, we'll see how this gets on, but unfortunately, too ill for the Isle of Wight, too ill for the Salisbury Gravel Epic. And uh, I don't know if I'm right for today, but we will see. I, I've literally only cycled from home and I'm already wheezing. <laughs> I think there's uh, five of us today. We're going to find uh, Dell and Justin over near Ditchit. So uh, hopefully it's not going to rain as much as the forecast as it is. Fancy meeting you here. It's like the um, the alternative Snow White and the Six Dwarfs, isn't it? I'm not going to say who's dopey is, but we got Wobbly, Wheezy, Grump, Grumpy, <laughs> Smiley. <laughs> that just leaves you, Ben. <laughs> you it's been a long time hasn't it I've, I've not seen you since i played that joke on you you did <laughs> am i forgiven yet because your fan club were after me and particularly the welsh speaking ones i think they should be <laughs> we have a plan thank goodness for google translate so i knew what they were saying <laughs> yeah. Quite it takes a long time to type in Welsh. <laughs> what what did that say? Gobbly goop. Glob so glibsy. Glub glub It's just That's a mouthful, isn't it? There's there's vowels where there shouldn't be and there's consonants where there should be vowels. It's phonetic. <laughs> is that what it is? Yeah. <laughs> How many subscribers has he just lost? Just just saying I am too thick to understand what Welsh oh, is. Right. We're planning our revenge. <laughs> so much time. So much time. Yeah. yeah. Really warm. It's not as... No, you're wrapped up for winter. I know. And you've been out in it every day, commuting. Yeah. I haven't been out for two weeks, and I, I just guessed, and I think I've got it right. <laughs> well, I'd better to be over... You know, I can take it off now, can't I? <laughs> and then it'll go back on. And... Yeah. Where you been? We decided to add a climb into the right. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's twice you've gone wrong already, so, Pete. I know. you be hot. <laughs> Oh, which idiot put that climb in? Uh, you enjoy that one? Yeah. Got the views. <laughs> That's not the way we normally come up to here, is it? No, I was saying to Justin, it's, it's like Mon Von 2. There's three climbs up to here, and we've now done all three. I think that one's probably the worst one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You found out going. <laughs> I think I'm like Muttley laughing here now. <laughs> <laughs> Catch that pigeon. <laughs>
Is anybody else ready for a coffee or is it just me? No, we are ready, Darren. My legs are dying now. That was a long drag up here, but some nice views up here. I don't know where we are. I was trying to work it out, but I haven't. I think we're back in Somerset. I think we were back in Somerset when we went through that water. Because the roads were really nice in Dorset. We've come back into Somerset and we had a bit bit of water already. And judging by what's over there, is that a bit shitty? Oh yeah, it's gonna So yeah, definitely back in Somerset. We've made our way to the Walk Garden in Sherbourne for a much needed coffee and cake. Suggesting you go for the nine pound roast dinner or the nine pound toasted sandwich. <laughs> I went for the toasted sandwich, but yeah. But then it was a small roast dinner, so. It's, it's a small toasted sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> a bit pricey. Yeah. I, only, I only went for a cake in the end because I couldn't afford anything else. The only one I care about, yeah, about, yeah. Right, so we're now leaving Sherbourne, on our way to Sanford Orcus. Coffee and cake is done, an expensive toasted sandwich eaten, and it wasn't worth £9 from what they're saying. <laughs> but anyway, it's cold now, I feel really cold, and it's trying to drizzly rain. So uh, we're going to see if we can get back and avoid the rain, hopefully. I made it round so far. We're on the outskirts of Glastonbury, just coming into the village of Butley. Uh, so close to 90k. Lungs have been okay, although we haven't really done any major hills. We've done, we did the one big climb up at Cucklington, and I did say Cucklington. Other than that, my legs were tired after about 50k, and they're still very tired now. So if this video doesn't go up Sunday night, it's probably because I've fallen asleep on the sofa when I get home. Because uh, the fatigue has been the surprising thing from this COVID rather than anything else. It is just a bad flu. Uh, and I'm a former asthmatic and I think it's brought my asthma back. It's why I'm so wheezy, but hopefully that will clear. But anyway, the rain has held off. I think we've survived, which is very surprising. And we're just looking for a nice cruise now back into Glastonbury. With a tailwind, thankfully. Okay, so there we are. I've ended up doing 98 kilometres. Um, it was only supposed to be 90, so I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what I've done. But uh, yeah, that's just about enough for me today. Just a slow, slow recovery. We will get there. Uh, but yeah, really enjoyable ride today. Great to see the guys again. Um, and obviously, great to make another video again. So <laughs> I'm going to go in and edit it. Try not to fall asleep. And we will see you very, very soon, which should be probably next week, providing uh, the weather is there <laughs> because it's quite depressing now the clocks go back next week uh so it's quite depressing feeling knowing it's gonna be dark at four o'clock and that winter is finally here and it's a long long winter in the uk it's uh five six months <sighs> yeah not a lot to look forward to <laughs> but anyway at least we can look forward to it so anyway thank you for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and we will see you in the next video